Every year, a million people go to New Orleans, Louisiana for Mardi Gras. Can you throw Donald Trump's tax returns? <laughs> throw Donald Trump's tax returns! It's a celebration of beads, booze, and boobs. By the way, I can't show these on YouTube, so right. I'll be covering them up with a picture of okay. Hillary Clinton and Elizabeth Warren. That's awesome. Please do that. I'm here for four days to interview people. These aren't anal beads, are they? No, they're not. <laughs> no. Are you sure? Because they smell like anal beads. <laughs> Try the famous king cake. Did you see the baby in the middle? Oh my god, there's a baby in the middle? I guess that's part of the king cake. Every cake comes with a baby. And of course, make friends with the religious protesters. You got these whores exploding body parts. Woo! This is your wake up call, pervert. <laughs> Mardi Gras started off as a Catholic holiday or yeah, something. Yeah, a religious thing. So Looks like Jesus said, show me your tits and I'll give you some beads. Ah, yeah, like Jesus said. <laughs> and these are great because they can go from boobs to balls. <laughs> this is what your balls look like. Yeah, I've got a medical condition. What's your name? Ashley. If you want, I could try to match your voice. Oh, sorry, sorry. Just to make you feel better. You're good, you're good. Happy Fat Tuesday. Fuck yeah, man. <laughs> or as Chris Christie calls it, regular Tuesday. <laughs> The crowd pleases the bitch teaser, you know what I'm saying? Wait, what I got are you all saying? the toppers you need like a domino pizza, you know what I'm saying? What are you saying? Shangle the Mac, the crowd pleases. The bitch teaser, the crowd pleases. I got all the toppers you need like a domino pizza, you know what I'm saying? I, what are you saying? I like the guy driving. Can you zoom in on the guy driving? He could not care less about this whole thing. <laughs> he does not give a shit. The maids are throwing out beads. The driver is just throwing out sadness. Coming back to Mardi Gras is one of my greatest things I ever did to myself. Yeah. When's, the, when's the last time you were at Mardi Gras? The last time I was at Mardi Gras was 1954. Mardi Gras was a scary place back in 1954. Now I feel like I'm at a presidential inauguration. <laughs> it's beautiful. I love it. Can you throw us some single-payer health care? <laughs> I have enough beads. Really could use some single payer health care. Throw us what Denmark has. Whatever Denmark has. Hello everybody. Happy Mardi Gras. This is my girlfriend. This is my boyfriend right over here. We're having relationship problems We're right now. A really what? We never have We never have problems. That's a lie. We never have problems. So you always contradict me. You're always contradicting me. You always contradict me. Hey look, it's Maeve from Joe Goes to Berlin. Yes. It's all muscle. <laughs> yeah, it's me. <laughs> you followed me all the way to Mardi Gras. I did, yeah. I just couldn't get enough of you. You're a disturbing stalker. <laughs> you love Jesus? Yeah, yes, man. You love Jesus? Jesus loves you. Yes. Hey, it's all good, baby. I came all the way from... Do you love Xenu? Yeah, I love Zeno and G. Right. No, Jesus first, <laughs> then Zeno. Okay, yeah, that's a good order. Welcome to the annual Save the Environment Festival. We're all doing everything we can at Mardi Gras to save the environment. You're dressed as... Macho Man Randy Savage, yeah. You know who you could have been? Sex Tape Hulk Hogan. <laughs> Does anybody really want to be that, though? <laughs> Would you like to start a serious relationship? Serious relationship? I don't, I don't know. Like, like at least a seven year relationship. Seven years? That's just fucking long. I am at the face paint nipple glitter booth. With Christy. Is this ever going to come off? It's very water soluble. It comes oh. right off. One time I wore glitter and it was like herpes. It wouldn't go away. Right. Exactly. <laughs> My herpes also hasn't gone away. Well, it tends not to. That's the gift that keeps on giving. It looks like a, uh, an alien elf jizzed all over your face. That's what I was going for. Yeah. I look like Mike Tyson, but fabulous. Just scream, I have low self-esteem. They'll give you more beads. I have low self-esteem. I have low self-esteem. Let me get some beads. Give me beads. Give me beads. Yeah. Yeah, see? Yeah. Mardi Gras ninjas show you their... Jesus Christ. What's going on over here? What? I can't read your sign. You're going too quickly. I'm really sick of this all white, all male fucking parades and I'm sick of it. White men are boring. They're fucking boring. We are pretty boring. White men are fucking boring. I have low self-esteem. I have low self-esteem. You know what's sad? I've been here for like six, seven, eight hours. The only, the only person who's flashed the camera is you. That's it. Are you excited to show your tits? 
<laughs> no, we almost went to jail for that one last, last night. We went, we went to the Meadow Parade last night. My mom showed her boobs. Got dragged by the cops. It was a family parade. Does anyone want some beads? I'm throwing them anyway. What? <laughs> I hit a dude with them. Yeah! This is a gender neutral balcony. We throw to men too. I'm hanging with Maeve and I'm about to check out a king cake. This is one of the characteristic pastries of Mardi Gras. Mmm. Yum. <laughs> Look at those appetizing colors. It's like a fairy shat all over it. Yeah, I don't judge a book by its cover. I'm willing to try it. How many more beads can you people actually wrap around your stiff neck? You got these whores exposing body parts. Woo! Happy Mardi Gras! Oh. the Starks float. Please throw Ned Stark's severed head. Don't pick him up off the other ground. Wow, you just caught one now? <laughs> Snip into a Slim Jim, yeah! Can you say, slip into some kale, oh yeah! <laughs> that is just sacrilege. Macho Man doesn't do kale. Let's Come hear on. what it sounds like. <laughs> Snip into some kale, yeah! Do you think if Hillary had nipple glitter, she would have won the election? Absolutely. Hillary needed nipple glitter to win the election. That could have made all the difference. Absolutely. Go Hillary! We're followers of Christ. We're just down here sharing the good news of Jesus. So what brought you here? Mark I'm, I'm with Clowns for Satan. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, we all start somewhere. Who needs beads? Titties! Titties! They're my home, girl. In 1954, were women flashing for beads like they do now? Oh, heck no. You couldn't flash for beads back in 54. But now they can. Matter of fact, yeah, this is amazing in, in Columbus, Ohio. You can walk around at Broad and High Street. With, with, your, with your breasts out, and it's all right. But now, at 81 years old, if I pull my penis out, they want to put me in jail. It's never been fair. It's always been lopsided. Yeah. But it's all right. You're talking about your penis or the law? Pardon me? Can I see your dick? Can I see your dick? Your dick. Boobs are fun. Dicks are depressing. <laughs> They're kind of I wouldn't be that harsh. I wouldn't be that harsh. <laughs> I was ready to show you, but then but then you turned it around. We need your dick. I've got a dick. I know what you guys really want to see. Oh, God. <laughs> Just imagine a giant vanilla Tootsie Roll. Oh! Oh, God. Imagine a slab of margarine that's been sitting outside. <laughs> that's so bad. Imagine an old plantain. Well, we can work through it. Do you think we can work through it? Yes, we're going to start therapy. What's your tonight. name again? Joe. Joe, I'm Paige. This is, a, this is the, the issue. You don't remember anything I tell you. Right. You don't remember my name. You don't remember my birthday. Come you on, Joe, we're dating! You we're remember dating. how amazing I am in bed? You're amazing in bed, Joe! I fucking love you, man! <laughs> What's the craziest thing you've seen at Mardi Gras? I saw two people having sex. I love titties! Someone said, um, give me your beads or whatever, and then we looked down, <laughs> his dick was out. The drunk driver who injured 28 people? Oh, yes, yeah, some, some he drunk driver, driver drove through a crowd of people and injured a bunch of people. Really and ran over My GPS said to go straight. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Somebody actually pissed on me on Bourbon Street. I was like walking down and I felt something wet and I turned around. He was just peeing all over me. So I knocked him out. You knocked him out? Yeah, and then they tried to arrest me. The cop came up and was like, you're under arrest for assault. And I was like, um, I got assaulted. I was like, they peed on me. And he just looked at me and I took my shirt off and gave it to him. And I was like, smell it if you want. What's this? Drink some of this shit. Drink. 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 Out, I'm 34. I'm looking to start a family. I think I think you might be the perfect person to do that with. I cannot do that. I'm sorry. Where's Lil Wayne at? We don't know. I wish I knew. What brings you to New Orleans? Jazz. Jazz. You're a musician. I sure am. Weed, 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 drug, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I think you just found the next hook for your pop single. Weed, 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 drugs, blah, blah, blah. We need to We need bitches. We need, we need hookers. We need hookers. We. That's like what a white man would say. What the fuck are you? Did you see my sign? You can go away. Throw these. 
That's a good idea. Look at this flashy fucking thing. Would you like this flashy thing? Why are you ignoring me? 330,000 subscribers! Did you see the baby in the middle? Oh my god, there's a baby in the middle? I guess that's part of the king cake. Every cake comes with a baby. If you don't eat the baby, you're pro-life. Is it weird what, that I'm like sucking on a baby's feet? Well, yes, it is weird that you're sucking on a baby's feet. That's not what mothers do, and I hope you never become a mother if that's what you're gonna do to your baby is. Oh, <laughs> that's an awful thing to say. How many diseases does he have? HIV. <laughs> <laughs> he deserves HIV. You deserve a venereal disease. You deserve syphilis and gonorrhea. You are wicked before God. You deserve love. Wicked before. God. You deserve How love. Can this guy be? No wonder God destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah for people like him. God says he's an abomination. Show me your you boobs. The God of the Bible. Show me your boobs. Serious about God. Boobs for beads. Or hell when you die. Show me your boobs. Show me your boobs. Show me your boobs. Show me your boobs. And you will soon join him if you don't know the God of the Bible. Wow, you guys have a ton of beads. You gotta do what you gotta do. I'll give them to you if you write an essay about feminism. Oh, I, I can't do that right now. How did you get them? Somebody threw them to you or? I had to shave some women's back hair. <laughs> that may have been a bit much. Can someone throw my dignity back to me? I think you could never get that back. And that's, a, that's an image you could never get out of your head. No more beads. No more! Silk pillows? Can you throw some silk pillows? Oh my god, it's the Pope! The cross is actually a T for tits. Few people know that. That's exactly what it stands for. This stands for tits. Tits are just something for babies to suck on. And I was upset when I was a baby too. I was two years old when my baby brother was born, about a month from being two years old. And when he got in my mama's lap and took my titty, I tried to choke his ass to death. <laughs> That's my titty. <laughs> get away from my titty. I won't show my boobs to get beads because... What about just to get a good meal? Huh. No. <laughs> they should combine Mardi Gras with breast cancer checkups. They should, they should. Maybe a girl would be flashing like, woo! And then a doctor comes up and says, I have terrible news. Do you want a shot? Hey! Hey! Hey, do you need some Pedialyte? Let's go keep you alive. Want to keep hydrated? I do want to keep hydrated. It's a marathon, not a sprint, so... 20 beer limit every day and I've seen a lot of people who thought it was a sprint <laughs> and down <laughs> yesterday we were leaving the Bacchus parade and we saw a bunch of girls on the street just like this <laughs> have you seen any vag flashes no, no thank, thank god. god thank god <laughs> that's the first time I've ever asked that question yeah, before <laughs> yeah, I think I would have to leave New Orleans if I saw some of that more booby painting than faces but no dong painting. No, absolutely not. No butt painting. No butt painting. Although I, I wouldn't mind. I'd paint a butt or two. I love you too. Do you love me? It's been three years now. You better fucking love me, Joe. Oh no, she's pregnant. She's pregnant already. <laughs> I'm pregnant. Well, now I got to take off. Good luck with that. Thank you, Joe. This contraption is a Mardi Gras ladder. It's for children, so they can get up a little higher and get the goods. Oh wow, I'm finally at a normal height. <laughs> No, none of that. I felt this hand like reaching between my legs. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I looked down and you said, sorry, I thought there's a cup down there. <laughs> I know. But you know what? I think there's another cup down there if you want to try to find it. No! Stop! Feel free to take another look. No. I know it's tough because I live in Los Angeles and you live here. Oh, you live in Los Angeles? Yeah, well now you're interested. Now she's awesome. interested. <laughs> Show your tits for some beads. Dragons live in the ocean. <laughs> Shrooms are very popular at Mardi Gras. <laughs> I got a blowjob shot from a girl. Blowjob shot? Yeah. What's a blowjob shot? She stuck three little tubes in her mouth and I took it from her mouth and <laughs> Give me beads! More! I have no self-esteem! Mine! Mine! I have had a great time. This has been a wonderful, beautiful Mardi Gras. And you can end it all by pulling the, your penis out. All I want to invoke is passion. All I invoke is awkwardness. Is that a that's, that's a form of passion. Oh, it is? Oh, yeah.
<laughs> he's right now, but he's pretty cool. And he likes to drool and drool, because he's a man. Yeah, yeah. And this is an Asian man. Yeah, yeah. But Diversity! 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 This is the Hurricane, one of the most famous drinks in New Orleans. It's so strong, it's like four drinks in one. Which means after you take it, you'll have four times the regrets and four times the We're vomit. Good time I can't wait. Roll. This isn't about you. Would you ladies like a flashy thing? I've got a flashy thing. Not even a little bit, thanks. Uh, there's jam inside. That looks promising. It's blueberry. Oh. All right. It is like a cinnamon bun. It's not bad at all. If I have more, I'm going to have a heart attack, but um, I'm glad I tried it. Once again, Maeve is wrong about everything. Yeah. I am from Florida. Uh, I didn't ask you your life story. Did shit to us. It did shit to like all. I'm drinking to forget this conversation. This is your wake up call, pervert. You're gonna get it in the end, all right, homo. You're gonna get it with AIDS. You're gonna get it with a venereal disease. And you call yourselves gay. I'm not you're gay. As frustrated Yay. and wicked as it gets. I'm not gay, though. No, you're not. You're right. You're miserable. You're wicked. The last thing you are is gay. All right. <laughs> got my nails ripped off by some beads. Thou shalt giveth beads for boobs. I wish I read that in the Bible. <laughs> it's actually pronounced Nolens. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. Oh, to be that sign right now. You can only get away with shit like that in New Orleans. Especially on the planet Grumble 2. That's where Diglipoids cannot grom the flings of the Monkfloids. Wherever Joe goes, I go. I've never been surrounded by clowns before. This is terrifying. The microphone, look, I like this. Oh, official. <laughs> yeah, baby. Well, I got thrown at me where restraining orders. Can you please show me your dick? I'm sorry, we want to... <laughs> show me your dick! Boy, you better keep that in your pants. She's a feminist, I think. She's gay. Hey, we should... Uh, we should all be bi. We should. We should all be bi. This is my, my special girlfriend. This is Kathy Cole. She's Don't put me on it. Screw it, screw it, screw it, I don't care anymore. Hi, this is Mardi Gras, it's the best time in the world. Where's Andre? <laughs> no one cares what they do in Europe. All right, all right. Is this like a porn site? Because you are the ultimate white man. If you kiss me, I'll be a feminist. They don't like Mardi Gras. They don't like Mardi Gras. Freestyle rap, give me a suggestion and I'll rap about it. Four girls from Dallas, they came down here to have a good time. Hear it. All right. And it's Amber, Ashley, Jenna, and April. All right. Well, you know that I'm not known for ballads, but here's a rap about these girls that are from Dallas. Yeah. I'm not thinking about my exes because I'm meeting all these sexy girls from Texas. Yeah. This is crazy. I ran into you last night when I was shooting my vlog. Show your boobs to my YouTube channel. Invisible boobs. Not showing my boobs, I'll show my invisible boobs. I guess we'll call you invisible boobs. <laughs> Hi, I'm invisible boobs. It's so nice to see you all again. Because we're gonna party now. Yes, it's insane. Have you had the drink yet? It's called the hurricane. Yeah, I'm hanging out with these girls. It's no worry, even though I'm pretty sure this one might be a furry, but that's fine. <laughs> I'm loving all your little hats as I can spit my stupid fucking little raps. Yeah, I'm just rhyming to impress you because maybe later if you get drunk you might let me undress you. <laughs> oh my god! Shit, that is good! I don't really want to be critical. I can't see your boobs because they're invisible. <laughs> Mardi Gras. This episode was directed and shot by Mike Hogan, who shot another Mardi Gras video that you should really check out. Yeah, it was of a, of a Star Wars themed parade called Chewbacca's, where a company I work with built a land speeder and drove it around, so you'll enjoy that. Just check out the card or the link in the video description. Uh, uh, subscribe to Joe Goes!
You can't mess with the Joe Ghost Posse. You can't mess. You will never mess. Huge fan of the YouTube channel. Keep on doing what you're doing. Are you going to be on your YouTube channel? You are. <laughs> We're getting interviewed. Yeah. This is so funny that we ran into each other again. I put it on my Facebook. I showed all my friends. <laughs> Do you want my car? Yeah. I don't have it with me. I was cracking some jokes about the trash, but they do clean that up like in the early hours, right? Well, yeah, but I mean, dear God, man. Yes, and actually the way we the way we estimate crowd size every Mardi Gras is by the number of trash runs. How many trucks full of trash right. are pulled out of all of this? New Orleans, better than Berlin. They're both really different. Like Berlin is... Worse. Is is worse? Fucking cold. Worse. It's snowing worse. and it's it's worse. It's white. Worse. It's white. Worse. How did you do that? It was amazing. This is what I do. Wow. I'm so proud of jo Joe Hansen. Yo, it's Ghostface Killer. I want y'all to subscribe to Joe Ghost. He's a very nasty boy from US. <laughs> no worries, Mike. Subscribe. It's all good. <laughs> no. It's not an orgy. Women only, women only. You're not a professional. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> little rude. Sorry. <laughs>